welcome viewers if still you're not subscribed to this channel kindly subscribe and also click the bell icon to get technology updates regularly on this jp infotech channel hi in this video we are going to see about a python project which is entitled as tomato leaf disease identification using vgg16 so this is the IEEE base paper which is entitled as tomato leaf disease identification by restructured deep residual dense network but we have not implemented the complete paper which is mentioned as in this IEEE paper but instead we have used replacing that using VGG16 architecture now let us see the execution of the project Now copy this URL, go to your browser, paste it and now you can see the home screen or welcome screen of the project with the project title Tomato Leaf Disease Identification Using Deep Learning or VGG16 and you can click login. So this is a static login page with the default username and password as admin and ad admin and then click login and once the login is successful you can upload the data set image and also you can preview it so just select the browse option go to the project folder and here you can see the upload file option here you can see the the different types of diseases so let us uh, check with few cases now so now let me select this and here you can preview the the image that we have uploaded and then click submit and now you can see the prediction result the prediction result is bacterial spot now let me go to the preview menu and select some other image say example this and then click submit and wait for the prediction result and now you can see the pre prediction result it is yearly blight the prediction result is yearly blight now let me go again back to the preview and select some other data set image so say example this then click submit and here you can see the prediction result is leaf mold now coming back to the preview i will upload from this example let me select this and then click submit and now you can see the prediction result is septoria leaf spot now again let me upload some other data set image from LO leaf curl virus and then click submit and now you can see the prediction result is yellow leaf curl virus so I have shown you with the few cases for the disease uh, with the disease uh, cases now let us show with the normal case that is a healthy one so let me upload uh, the healthy one and then click submit and now you can see the prediction result is tomato healthy one so for the few scenarios i have shown you with the data set images you can check with the some other data set images also with all the cases that we have given in the upload folder now let us go to the next step that is performance analysis so in the performance analysis you can see the accuracy of our performance analysis which, which is 0 0.848 precision which is 0 0.954 and recall value with 0 0.848 and f measure value is about 0 0.848 and here you can see the confusion matrix with the true label and the predicted label
and at last it is the chart this chart is not a dynamic one it is a static one this this is being plotted with the data set records that that is we are given in the upload folder so it is a static one not a dynamic one so you can see the cases with the bacterial part about 19.5 percentage health is about 14.16 and leaf mold about 17.1 percentage yearly blight about 22 percentage and septorial leaf spot around 14.6 percentage and yellow leaf curl virus around 12.2 percentage and this is all about the project tomato leaf disease identification using deep learning or vg16 architecture and thank you for watching